Not so good, yeah, was. They don't really, I don't know. I don't really gel with them. They that's mostly give me night great. night uh, shifts to work on. That's not all that good. Yeah. Anyhow, you have to see something I've been working on. It is, it is something very really unique and different. So basically, I have attached a keyboard to a monitor. And it is like a keyboard terminal which I, which you input and you display on the monitor. Very good. Right off the What are you Come to my garage, I'll show you. Okay, then. let's go. Yeah, let's go. I hope it's something substantial. Yes, Steve, I've been working on something. It is a terminal board connected to a keyboard. I hope you like it. This is so, it. so it's like a kit. Yeah, it is a kit. So it's it. I've What's it? I've been working on it. It's the board's a lot open there. This is what it is. It's a terminal board connected to a monitor. So what does it exactly do? It, you print, you type on the monitor, and it shows it on the screen. Look, boss. Yes, I know you've been working on HP for a long time. I need you to see the potential of this. This is amazing. HP didn't even care about this. This could change everything. This could change the history of personal computing worlds. This is brilliant. But Steve, I only created this as a hobby. Exactly, was you created something as a hobby. And you willed it into existence. Can't you see it? This is artistic. This is freedom versus everything. Steve, calm down. I only created a computer. Why would someone want to buy a computer? Was. How does someone know what they want to buy if they haven't even seen it? So, what do you call this thing, this operating system? Steve, if we have to sell it, we have to give it a name. Yeah, I've been thinking about that as well. So, what do you have in mind? Um, I was thinking enterprise computers? Hell no. It's gotta be something catchy, like, I mean, something you can relate to. Like, like you see it and you want it. Yeah, Steve, but like what? Uh, apple. Excuse me? You mean the fruit apple? Yeah. Fruit of creation, apple. It's simple yet sophisticated. Yeah, something like apple computers. Apple computers. Yeah, I think I'll be Bye bye. It has to be intuitive, precognitive. I mean, I want you to know what you have to do before you even know you have to do it. I'm still talking about, I'm talking about everything. Guys, Lisa's gonna do for the next 10 years what the Apple do did for the last three. I can tell you that right now. And the commander? Yeah. And they'll We've raised the bar, and if we want to stay there, we've risked everything. Dylan, Picasso, Newton, they all risked failure. And if you want to stay up there, we got to risk it too. There are 20 different functions tied to every single variation of command power, where we're going to take weeks to work for We're not doing anything that IBM is already doing. And I'd rather gamble on our vision than make a Me Too product. Why do you think we buy an Apple? Why do you think customers buy an Apple and not the competitor? It's got bravado. It's social status. Even more than it's social currency. Product, but we need to convince people that what we're selling is even greater, and that's what the Mac is. It's not a computer. We're not selling a computer here. We're selling a tool for the mind, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is limitless. Because people will never stop believing that they can get more out of something be it at their money or their jobs. And that's what we have to do with the Mac. The belief in the limitless. Convince people that whatever they believe in, they can achieve it. And the Mac will get them there. A couple of months ago, when Steve came to visit me in Manhattan, he asked me a simple question. Do you want to keep selling sugar water your whole life? Or come with me and we'll change the world. So here I am at Apple, ready to change the world with all of you all. And I hope to continue working with to ensure Apple is a great company. Hello, with Steve. It is now 1984, and it appears IBM wants it all. Apple is perceived to be the only hope to give IBM a run for its money. 
will Big Blue dominate the entire computer industry? No. The entire information age? No. Was George Orwell right about 1984? No. When did this come in? Mm. It arrived this morning. It's just the read data. It's just played a little bit off. Everybody gets on the phone. Let me make this perfectly clear. So that when I'm done, you can still see through those thick, pretentious glasses, you psychopathic criminal. You stole my software and I can prove it in court. And I'm going to sue you for every cent that you have ever made. And I'm going to make it my life's mission to make sure that you don't make another dollar, that I don't fast like 90 cents. I'd like to divert resources from the Mac to the Apple II. It's overpriced. It's not overpriced. That, there's no proof for that. I'm the evidence. I'm the world leading expert in the Mac, John. What's your resume? I'm the CEO of Apple. You're an insub you're insubordinate. You're constantly uh, doing wrong things. The Mac has lost, the Apple has lost millions of dollars in value. And after that, you're talking about this. But before that, you sold carbonated sugar water, right? I sat in a bloody garage to watch that and invented the future. Because that's what inventors do. And I did change the world. Then why don't you help me? Steve, there's no reason to get angry. I'm the CEO of Apple. Ladies and gentlemen, if you wish to, if you want me to proceed in this company, it's either going to be me or it's going to be Steve. I'm giving you, I'll, I'll hand my hand, I'll hand over my resignation letter tonight. If you all want me to leave, but if you do want, please, I need Steve jobs out of the company as soon as possible. I would like to ask the secretary for a word. Ladies and gentlemen, wish to remove Steve Jobs from his company due to his constant insubordination and order to make Apple reach its true potential. People who wish to vote Steve Jobs out of the company. I think we have him there. We have made over 3 million units this year. A round of applause for that, please. Well, uh, maybe there's one more thing. I'm about to show you something that is amazing. Something that no one in the world has ever seen before. 
Now, Johnny and a small team of I have been working on this product for a long, long time. The product that I'm about to show you is going to completely revolutionize an entire industry. It's a music playing device. But we'll get to that in a minute. Because what it represents is as important as what it is. It's a tool for the heart. And when you can touch someone's heart, that's limitless. If I do say so myself, it's insanely cool. It's a music playing device. It's a thousand songs in your pocket. to the crazy ones, the misfits, the rebels, the troublemakers, the round pegs in the square holes, the ones who see things differently. They're not fond of rules and they have no respect for the status quo. You can quote them, disagree with them, glorify or vilify them. About the only thing you can't do is ignore them. Because they change things, they push the human race forward. While some may see them as the crazy ones, we see genius. Because the people who are crazy enough to think they can change the world are the ones who do. Steve, I created this just as a hobby. I told you know what they want if they haven't even seen it. What are you going to do? Boss! Boss! Samsung phone. Do you know what I'm going to do? 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 First, I want to see. थोड़ा और बोल रही है बजे परफेक्ट परफेक्ट है थ्री टू नो नो नहीं तो तब उस तरफ व्हाट्स माय लाइन चलेगा विच इस दिन लॉन्ग यू कैन रिमेंबर फिर सो व्हाट यू कॉल दिस थिंग दिस ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम स्टीव वी गॉट गिव इन अ नेम ये लाइन नहीं था फिर वो लाइन नहीं था व्हाट इस